Hello and welcome to another installment of Kaba Time. The top row, as usual, are more affordable Omegas. Start off with a few simple ones, a patinated Seamaster, two Medicus from the 1930s. These were the first ever center seconds Omegas. A beautiful blue Guilherme Toledo Dell, um, blue Sunburst Deville, nice grey herringbone Deville, and then two gorgeous big sizes. Uh, the left one, the subsecond, is 36.6 millimeters. The other is 36.3. Look at how they pop. Next row, we have Sea Masters and Genève. First up, uh, well, this one, it's um, a full set uh, Pristine Genève, but I was too lazy to get it out. Uh, then a nice Seamaster Deville with a white sunburst dial. Um, then a nice Seamaster pre-Deville. This is a Deville model, but um, it's from 1960, before they put Deville on the dial. Uh, earlier case model. Gorgeous white sunburst. Just pops really beautifully. Nice original loom dots as well. And a gorgeous coat hanger S. Then a very nice Black glossy gilt dial, um, a black meteorite dial which has been serviced, a nice white linen Genève, nice white sunburst, white honeycomb, and then two Seamaster Cosmics. This one has a special dial, it's a grey silver brushed dial with um, a deep blue ribbon. But just depending on how light hits it, it pops so differently. Cause like without light, it's more dark. With once light hits it, it's so beautiful. It's a very special one. Okay, next up we've got some very rare big sizes and constellations. First of the Seamaster 120 Big Blue, this is 43 in, uh, millimeters diameter. Then a uh, really big Seamaster Deville, 42 millimeters, this one. Uh, 37 millimeter, very rare, um, Japan market only, Omega Genève. Uh, 37, yeah, let me put this one. 36 gorgeous uh, subseconds because of the tiny bezel this really feels like 38 or even yeah it's where it wears really big really nice A gorgeous uh, constellation manhattan a nice solid gold constellation with box and papers beautiful 35 millimeter rose gold bumper automatic 18 karat solid gold this one 14 karat solid gold, um, Omega Genève automatic. This one 18 karat solid rose gold as well. Beautiful square, really crispy with original buckle. Then we have some really, really nice ones. Uh, first of uh, 220 misprint Speedmaster, full set with box papers and extract from the archives. It's a uh, well, pretty much sold, but uh, at this moment it's still available, but tomorrow the buyer will come. Then a gorgeous Ranchero, um, reference 2990-1, um, a Seamaster with, well, the same Ranchero dial and hands, this is a 2937. Then uh, Omega 2165, which is uh, India CSI, the, well, it's the civil servants India, which was issued by the British Empire to their civil servants who were stationed in India. Then we've got a record KA and a GA. This one was issued to the Kenya army. This one was issued to the uh, Ghana army. And then a Belova one at 1917H, which was issued to the US military in the Korea War in 1950. Then, next up, we have Cartier, Rolex, Tudor, and Jaeger Le Coultre, a lot of them. First up, a lovely ladies, Cartier Colise, gorgeous rare Rolex um, with a very rare dial. Nice Tudor with a um, champagne linen dial, 
two tin simple cultures gorgeous all original future medic with white dial one of the first models made a gorgeous uh, white sunburst crosshair dial 35 millimeters nice big size very nice one of the nicest on well around um power wind another nice power wind fab swiss with some patina then two gorgeous uni plants from the 1940s might be 1930 i forgot um uni plan etrier in regular uni plan really nice then we have some very affordable watches uh, these are from the 40s and these are more well older 60s most of them um first of a very nice eterna automatic it's a bumper automatic from the 40s all original black um, gilt dial gorgeous able with uh, blued hands then two onces this one gorgeous black gilt dial like the eterna this one a white military dial then um, a very nice big size festina which is pristine then yeah a bunch of others this one especially very nice the valjean or however you pronounce it it has a sweet squirrel on the back so yeah quite something then um, a few others, well, Alice Watch, Commando, Ariosa, and then this one, the Corvette. This one, luckily, isn't a fast Corvette. It's just the right speed. Then we've got some mechanical alarm watches and chronographs. First of two mechanical alarms, uh, UT uh, or UTI and Saliva. These two have nothing to do with each other um, then a bunch of chronographs um, well different models many landron um, just beautiful rose gold with guilloche dial um, yeah I'll just scroll over them this one really nice salmon dial and yeah plenty more then the last row some more beauties a really gorgeous um, blue sunburst Tissot with an omega based movement, white sunburst crosshair Tissot, gorgeous blue brushed Longine, two gorgeous divers, and then some more zenits with a really nice tank as well. Hope you like them. Um,